let's talk about a little bit about inflammation and diet and healthy tissue. Cause I have been passionate about like anti-inflammatory foods for a long Me time too. before it was like known. I was like that weird, weird girl who didn't want the GMOs and the artificial ingredients. And I was that person who's like, don't use Johnson and Johnson on my baby. And they're like, you're so crazy. Who cares? Um, so, you know, endocrine wow, disruptors isn't that are funny? People aren't saying that now. <laughs> I know. And so I've just, I've known about it for a long time. Um, I was kind of that weird person, but I didn't care because I knew about it. Right. And so I know in here we've got, you know, the anti-inflammatory recipes and the autoimmune protocol, which is fantastic. If anyone is autoimmune, especially as women, so many women have autoimmune and I'm always happy reach out. If you have questions, you know, we are here to help you. Um, it's also, I have to tell you, Courtney, one thing that probably isn't in the course, but we can just throw it in as a nugget to reinforce what you're doing um, in terms of just strictly inflammation is that when we did our study through blood, we measured the C-reactive protein, which is the systemic inflammation, right? Yeah. Uh, it's the thing that well is it known yet i don't know if these are things that are known but like it it really is what triggers um the autoimmune response and also it triggers it within the fascia which we can get off into the acids <laughs> at some point if you want to want to but um at the end of the day you know when you combine it's kind of like to me when you look at trying to be anti-inflammatory you look across the board and fascia blasting is just one more proven thing to actually bring down at a systemic level inflammation, a Which cellular is so level. Powerful. And I feel like anti-inflammatory is becoming like a buzz and people don't really understand. It's like a cumulative effect, right? What we eat, what we put on our skin, the fascia, it's all cumulative. It's, it's years in the making. So while you might think, oh, who cares? Let me not exercise, let me not take care of my fascia, let me eat like crap. You might not feel it now, but five, 10, 15, 20 years, you're gonna majorly feel it, you know? And it's just so, so important. So we've got tools in here for your diet, um, better, we've got a giveaway with it, and we've got like food, and then the fascial component is just huge with the inflammation and keeping that at bay, which is, and, and then our diet is going to affect how responsive our tissue is, right? So as oh. we're doing this program, that's why I wanted to include, you know, dietary and more anti-inflammatory foods and plans is because if our tissue is just so inflamed and not responding because we have so much internal inflammation, let's like give it a breathing room so the fascia can respond better and it's going to help even more um, and the muscles. So it's just so important. Well, about that too, you know, we're talking about like just from a real basic understanding, you don't want to put garbage in when fascia blasting is trying to take garbage out. Yes. Not only is it breaking up adhesions, but when we fascia blast, we're stimulating the lymph system and the fascia houses the lymph system. So I would just encourage like as many things as people can do to be clean. You know, I love that you've introduced the food and I kind of heard you say it through the grapevine, but it's like, there's all kinds of ways that we take in toxic bullshit, right? It's and, fun. And trying you know, to and, stay and we away. can't, we can't like help, right? Like if there's, we're breathing air that could be toxic, but like the nonstick pans people use, those are really horrible for you and leach into our food. The plastics that people use as food the containers. There's plastic. little things people can do. Your cleaners, um, how close you live to cell tower, like all that. Yeah. Yeah. So all of those things are just so important. And we're going to be talking about this. There's going to be posts about it. Um, there's there's more information we're gonna provide everyone, but I just, I had to address it because it's just so essential. 